Good day to you. I am Wayne Daniels of Evil Motion. Today I would like to show you an amazing exercise which we all do every day on numerous occasions. The squat. For one thing, you have to sit on the toilet. You have to squat down to do that. And well, if we can't do that very well, we're in trouble. The front squat, to me, is far better, especially for a beginner. Because the benefit of placing the bar in front of you, as opposed to behind you, is that the weight on the front automatically pulls you forward. So I have to resist there. So, as if by default, you unerringly engage the extensor chain to counter the weight, or you'll be put forward. So it's very good for beginners. It pulls them into a better postural position and better form. <clears throat> and then you can have a new novel experience of movement instead of repeating old patterns. So here we go. Feet nice and evenly. And one thing, most beginners will want to put their weight on the balls and toes of their, of their feet. Very conscious we have to be to help bring the, the weight, the body weight back and distribute it evenly between the balls and the heels. So a lot of the time <clears throat> I see that beginners do not put the weight on their heels and that's where a lot of connections to the extensor chain can happen and changes occur. So here we go. It's a nice tall spine, tongue in the roof of the mouth, feet nice and even, planted on the floor. Take the bar off, step forward. So, engaging the navel, intra-abdominal pressure, drawing the navel in before you squat, engages the body and gives stability, as opposed to what I call ordinary abdominal pressure, where you're pushing out on your stomach and you're not using the deep muscles, so you have to... Take a deep breath, engage the navel to the spine. Deep breath, engage that navel in. Feel those feet nice and evenly distributed, the weight. Keeping the back nice and extended. So now let me show you some poor form. So, so you can see the difference there, keeping the spine erect, navel engaged. Feet firmly planted on the floor evenly between the balls and the heels of your feet. And there you go. Get squatting. It's healthy. Wayne Daniels. Thank you.